wasn't necessarily that, but my calves were really flared up during the race um, in the last five miles or so. I don't know, something's not right with it right now. But, you know, put myself in it and come with them as long as I could. You know, uh, Alpine crushed and couldn't be more proud of her. Um, I feel like we, I feel like we made the team. Um, she made it, she gets to go, but it was certainly a collective effort through the, the whole process and her uh, achieving that. So, extremely proud of her, um, her efforts, and it's very well deserved. Can you say something about Alephine? What is she like? You oh my gosh, Alephine is hilarious. She's so funny. Um, she's a great person. Um, has a fantastic personality. Uh, she's we make fun of her a little bit because uh, she every time she shows up to practice, she'd be like, "Oh, ladies, you know, I don't know how this is gonna go today. This is gonna. I don't think I can do this workout. I can't do it today. I had like a little tickle in my throat last night. Um, I feel kind of tired. You know, there's always like one thing after the other where you're like." Okay, Alphine, we fed into this like the last five times, but we're kind of gonna ignore you now. And then she'll go out, she'll do the workout, she'll crush the workout, and repeat again in two days when we have another workout. Um, but she's, no, she's fantastic. Um, we certainly couldn't have a better person here presenting our United States team. The, the team, you guys got three of the top eight. I mean, you guys really all brought it. Is that fair to say? I'm sorry. You really brought I'll it. You, yeah, I'll see if you guys brought it. I would say. I mean, yeah, I mean, I wish I could have brought um, a little more, right? A little more. Yeah, absolutely. I don't think that would, today was my best day, but it certainly is nice to be able to have you know my teammates right there, you know, in that tap eight. I think that that certainly says something about um, the program that we have at Northern Arizona. Do you know what's next to this one? What's next? Yeah. Um, I'm probably gonna go to Disney World. Uh, just to kind of uh, recoup and, I don't know, realign kind of my next goals. Uh, I'll certainly do track. That was kind of in the plans the other way. Um, so kind of relax and get ready for, you know, the next phase and the new road to Tokyo. Yeah, did your success last year give you a lot of confidence for the track? Um, you know, it's, it's certainly nice to know that I can hang with somebody of Emily and Molly's, Molly's caliber. Um, when they have such a great pedigree on the track. So, yeah, I mean, I think that I'm going to go into those trials with as much confidence as I did these and hopefully have a little bit better results. Um, I don't know exactly what mile it was, but all I know is my calf just kind of blew up. Um, you know, just kind of hung in there, did what I could. Got to the finish line. I was kind of surprised, honestly. There weren't like 30 people passing me uh, those last couple of miles, but it was in the final 10k. Oh, absolutely, yeah, probably final 10k for sure. Um, yeah, I don't know. I gave it what I had, and I'm not necessarily disappointed in my effort. It's what I had today. And, you know, I I can't. I mean, I'm excited because. I'll be the team. So. Was it a gradual thing? Like at 16, did you know it or did it suddenly pop up? My cat? Yeah. It was the whole race. It was the whole race. It was the whole race. It just got uh, bad enough. You're good actor. It got bad enough. Yeah. Was it the tap? There's other women there to help you kind of push through that, making you different. Um, well, the last 10K, we kind of were supposed to write out that it was kind of like, you know, just get from one K to the next K until you finally. You know, I think when we were at 24 miles, I was like, okay, I'm going to get to the finish. It's not going to be fast, but I'll get there. <laughs> you you said you had shins before? Was the calf bug bothering you before too, or just yeah. the calf new today? No, it's kind of, it's been this whole leg. My whole right leg has kind of been a major issue, which is new. I don't usually have um, things, and I kind of try to push them in the back of my head. Um, not think about them going into the race, get it taken care of, but go in with the thought that it's not going to play a part in the race. Um, unfortunately, I think that it certainly did, but, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. When did that start bothering you in training? When did what? Like, how long ago? How long has been bothering you in training? Six weeks. Now that Alfie is going to the Olympics, like, training and everything, it doesn't look like for you guys. Do you think you'll still, like, join our... Yeah, 
Yeah, I think we will certainly have uh, some things together. Um, you know, I'm going to have to deal with even more uh, Ally optimism. <laughs> She's kind of the eternal optimist and is like, Oh, ladies, good morning. What a beautiful day it is. And gives everybody a hug. Like every time she sees you. I'm not a hugger, but I get Ally hugs all the time. <laughs> so, you know, she'll be on cloud nine. She'll probably cry along. Give her tons of hugs. And, you know, hopefully we can be a part of her, her build up to that very much. Oh, man. 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 Oh, man.